What's going on guys, the I'm Jesse here and welcome back to my new LEGO Marvel minifigure comparison video. And today I'm doing the same character once again and that is Hawkeye, but this time he is in his first Avengers movie outfit from 2012. So we have two different versions of him. We have the old version from 2012 and the new one from last year based off of the new $500 Avengers Tower LEGO set. So I'm going to show you guys their front and back torso parts, their two different face prints, their hair pieces, their waist, and leg prints right here for the character itself for the lineup. So without further ado, let's go ahead and take a look at their torso so here we have their torso prints and they are officially different. So the one from 2012 has the different look for the outfit itself because it's in that like wider look that I'm going to say, but still it is different since it has that strap part because of the quiver part for the printing for his torso right here. And we have that different design for the zipper right here and the red lining structure right here, which is in that different look. And also we have the different design for those lining patterns on the left and right side of the torso right here. And we have those like strap pockets right here on that bottom part for the torso itself. And we have that little strap part for that upper waist part for him. So yeah, that is 100% different. And yeah, like I said, we have the strap part representing his quiver right here. So yeah, that is 100% different right here with the different patterns right here for the character itself and the one from last year is different right here so we have a shield logo on that top right corner part for the torso itself right here so this one doesn't have the shield logo but the one from last year does right here and it doesn't have the quiver strap part to it because it has the actual quiver piece right here and we have the different design for the zipper right here and the red lining structure right here and we have those like pouch pieces right here and that different design right there and so it's those straps right here since this one doesn't have those straps on the left or right side of the torso but this one does right here in my opinion and we had that like rectangular part for him for the top part for the torso itself while well, this one doesn't have that design right there and the printing for their waist are different so this one has a bit of printing right here with those two pouches on the left and right side of the hip part for the printing detailing itself while these top strap parts don't even connect together since they're off right here and this one has a different look since that is the leg piece right here that is used for Hawkeye and Falcon from that Avengers Tower set so yeah, it is different because it has the lining structure right here and it doesn't have those pouches right there. And for the leg printing itself, it is different. So the one from 2012 has the different straps right here on the left and right side of the leg right here. Since this one's on the upper part and this one's on the bottom part. While the one from last year is different since it has two straps on the right leg and one strap on the left leg. And we have the lining structure right here for the left or right leg for the character itself while well, this one doesn't have that and they do have different colors for their left hand so this one is black and this one is red representing that part for the bow part for how he's gonna shoot his arrows right here for their face prints they're different right here so this one has that angry expression right here in that different look so it is for the character himself trying to make it look like Jeremy Renner to me in my opinion because of the way it looks. And this one uses the other character melee like a semi Genji character from Lord of the Rings or something like that. But is in a different look. And they do have different hair pieces so this one has like a different sleeker look in that tan color. The white tan color. And this one uses the last year CMF Series 2 version in that darker tan color. Well Jeremy's, yeah Jeremy Renner's hair is dark brown and stand like a tan color to me in my opinion. His hair is usually dark brown instead of tan. And take a look at the back of them. This is what their back of their hair pieces looks like. Like I said, they are 100% different. Right here, this one's dark tan, this one's light tan, but in a different hair piece design right here. And this one has a back torso printing of his quiver right here, while the one from last year has the actual quiver piece right here. So I still like yeah, I love the nice detail for the strap part representing his quiver right here and the lining structure right here. And this one has the actual quiver part, like I said. And let's take a look at their second faces. So the one from last year doesn't have a second face, but this one does with the goggles right here. But in the movie, he didn't have the goggles on since he didn't wear them in the film right here. And let's take the quiver off from the one from last year. So I want to show you guys what his back torso printing looks like. I 
All right, there we go. So this is what his back torso printing looks like when you remove the quiver. So as you can see, it has the rest of the suit right here with that strap part and more of the dark and light gray lighting structures right here in that area part right here that is on top of his back torso printing. And this one, like I said, it has the printed quiver right here. So yeah, this one has the quiver that is printed and this one does not because like I said, that one has the actual quiver piece. But regardless, this is still a nice design for these to 2012 Hawkeye minifigures for the Lego Marvel lineup itself. So that is it for the whole comparison. Now let's go ahead and wrap this so, whole thing. Honestly, you guys, I love the one from last year the most because I love how nice and detailed it is and the torso is really accurate to the way it is in the movie because it did have a shield logo on it and some of the parts that are 100% accurate right here because the one from 2012 doesn't have the shield logo itself and it has all the straps right here representing the quiver part for the character itself but the 2012 version is still good but i honestly love the one from last year from that 500 dollars avengers tower set the most because i love the nice detail for the character itself with the front and back torso printing the leg printing and the actual quiver piece and we had that like accurate color for his left hand because in the movie it was red instead of black to me in my opinion but it has some Red design right here and more black, but still it is what it is. So, yeah, like I said, the one from last year came from the Avengers Tower set. And this one showed up in the old Avengers sets from the Lego Marvel theme from 2012, right before I started the channel in 2015, which is the Hulk Hulk Carrier Breakout set and even the Loki Cosmic Cube Escape set. So, I feel like those were like the only two sets that this version of Hawkeye showed up in. So... Yeah, I still love these two minifigures, but like I said, I rather prefer the one from last year the most because how nice and accurate it is. But regardless right here, these are nice minifigures, but the one from last year is the best one that I can pick right here because how the whole thing turns out. But anyways, I do not have anything else to say about these Hawkeye minifigures, but that's just the whole comparison for the two different versions of them in their 2012 outfits from the first Avengers movie based off of the Infinity Saga, but still they're good figures, but at least they're pretty nice for the lineup itself. So I don't have anything else to say about them, but that's all I've gotten so far right here for the lineup. So that is it for now. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell, the C button, and don't forget to Hulk smash that comment section down below. And tell me in the comments which version of Hawkeye do you guys like the most for the lineup. I'll see you later. Oh,